Okay, let's understand about calorific value. You must be wondering what is this calorific value? We know that when you burn various fuels, it produces heat. Okay? Fuel when burnt produces heat. Okay? Now, the quantum of heat generated by different kinds of fuel, let's say if you burn wood, let's say if you burn petrol, or let's say if you burn hydrogen, the amount of heat produced by these three items is different. Okay? Let's say this is equal to x, this is equal to y, and this is equal to z. So, how do we compare as to what is the quantity of heat which is being produced by each one of them? Because the more the heat, the better the product is. Right? I mean, you can keep on burning 100 kgs of wood, but if the same job can be achieved by 1 liter of petrol, you might want to do that. So, how do I know as to how I compare two or three types of fuels? So, calorific value basically is a measure which is used to find out how much heat is produced when 1 kilo joules also written as kg per gram is produced when 1 gram of fuel is fully burnt. So, let us say you burn 1 gram of wood, you burn 1 gram of petrol, you burn 1 gram of hydrogen. So, the calorific value is basically nothing but how much kilojoules. Kilojoules is basically the representing value. Just like you know you have kilograms, you have meter for length, you have liters for liquid for heat you have basically kilojoules. Now, based on prior experiences and all, the amount of calorific value of wood is 17 okay? and this is kilojoules per gram. For petrol it is around 47 and for hydrogen it is 150. So, when you burn 1 gram of wood, you generate 7 kilojoules of heat. Okay? Similarly, for petrol it is 47 and for hydrogen it is 150. Now, normally what happens is whenever you burn any substance, there is some amount of heat which is wasted. Okay? And the balance which is actually utilized for production of heat and everything is known as the efficiency of fuel. Okay? So, calorific value is basically nothing but how much of wheat heat is generated when 1 gram of a fuel is completely burnt.